It's good to have you along with us. We saw rainfall totals today up to as much as three quarters of an inch in some of the heavier downpours across McLennan and Limestone counties today, and even down in Bell County, uh, across portions of uh, uh, the Salado to Bridgeport area. You got some really good rain tonight as well. Better cloud cover still hanging around. This is a live look for the Bob Mills Furniture Sky Live weather camera, the HK Dodge and Loop. Temperatures today, because of the cloud cover and the rain, were much milder than you would anticipate for. Uh, uh, August 95 this afternoon and grows back. Our thanks to Debbie Fulmer for her report and Hewitt. Mary Corioth reporting a high of 96 degrees and we saw readings even warmer than that in a few spots that did not get any rain this afternoon. Up and down the I-35 corridors, very moist atmosphere sitting in place. This is the clear air mode and what you're getting is backscattered from whatever moisture the radar can pick up. Temperatures tonight are in the 70s in most cases. We're at 74 in Meridian, 77 in Waco, Marlin at 75, Temple's at 75, Colleen Coppers Cove reporting 79 degrees still. So as I said, there are some spots that got more sunshine than cloud cover and no rain that stayed pretty warm. Front is down to the south of us. I know it's odd to talk about a front in August or even July for that matter, but this has been a late season system that's come in, had a little punch to it, pushing rain all the way down to the Gulf Coast. It's now stalled down towards the Houston area right along Interstate 10, and that's where all the rain is really concentrated right now. We might see some wraparound moisture. You notice that low pressure that's associated with it, bringing in some moisture around the east and northeast side of it. So I'll go about 20% chance of a rain shower tomorrow. Otherwise, partial clearing tonight, mild conditions, 72 the overnight. Low, partly cloudy and warm tomorrow with a high of 90. And beyond a few spotty showers tomorrow, it doesn't look like we're going to see any additional rain until possibly the early part of next week. But the temperatures do start ramping back up again, getting close to where they would normally be in early August. We'll go 91 Wednesday, 93 Thursday, 96 on Friday. 97 Saturday and Sunday and a little bit breezy as well because the next system will be getting a little closer to us and get, maybe give us a rain shower by about Monday or so. Chris, Leslie. All right. Thanks, Andy.